and welcome back to the channel, my people. So happy to have you here. You already know that. I say that every time. We're at the Walmart right now. Uh, I hope you saw yesterday's video. We got to actually see a real WhatNot Live show in action. Flying Disc Contractor, he does such great shows. Factory Seal, Super Treasure Hunt on his live auction. Very reasonable prices. WhatNot is such a great app. Anyway, watch the video. Wow, shout out to the comments. Somebody found... I believe it was the raw Daytona, but I guess any one of them could be a chase. So it's like the old school style where it's not just one item. And that's interesting, right? Think about that. Maybe they're putting the only this is a chase on the one item instead of every item having a chance to be a chase. But yeah, I think someone said in the comments they found the raw of the Daytona. Absolutely amazing. But yeah, that is incredible, dude. Shout out to you, man. A raw Daytona? Come on, the Mercedes are right up front. That's so funny. I would almost buy them, but it's just not worth it. I'm going to leave them for other people, especially since they're right up front. Like, somebody did that for the people. Gosh, I almost... Well, I don't know. There was a big barrel. If you remember many videos ago, I was covered in Hot Wheels up to my knees. And a lot of these may have come out of that barrel so yeah m2 model kits we did get this chase i think it was the last chase of 2022 pretty cool and it had a sticker lots of these fox bodies left crazy i mean there's tons of model kits there is another uh green light we did not see the charlie's angels ford torino broham 1974 so oh Hey, oh gosh, the Jeep. You're not coming home with me. Now you chill. You chill. You're going. You're staying right. Oh, and the Roadmaster. It was hidden down here. All right, all good. I'm just gonna put it right up there. Yeah, I don't. I don't know. So, let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, and six. So not even one of them was taken. Interesting. Shout out to my guy collectibles. Really, I did get a confirmation again about giving away the damaged skylines. He said, you know what, just do it. He may even have new ones for me to get a fresh one. I would just get one this time just for me, and then we'll we'll do the sponsored giveaway. Please, everyone follow my guy collectibles both on Instagram and on the whatnot. I don't know exactly when the giveaway will happen, but between the next few shows, we'll do one, we'll do the other, maybe we'll do one on the YouTube's I, I don't know yet. very cool people definitely bought some of the auto worlds all right we need to check my my Mustang I think it's the red that we got from this Regarding series my guy collectibles I've never asked you guys to do anything but please go on his Instagram leave a comment somewhere just saying thank you for the skyline giveaway on on TFM or the Florida man whatever you don't have to go crazy but please a couple of you it doesn't have to be everyone a couple of you please just you know my guy collectibles on his Instagram like a picture or something and just thank him for the giveaway because this is pretty big of him to do honestly those cars are not cheap they're, they're not cheap cars. Little inventory update here at this Wally, which is totally under the transition phase, and I can see the, the signs everywhere on every aisle. Even the guy that works here was like, yeah, dude, it's gonna be a while. Some of the items can't even be like price tagged until a certain date. Their system won't even allow them to come out. So uh, and it, it's gonna be rough, not just for me, but for a lot of people, wow, tons of Hot Wheels skate. Somebody is just going through and clearing the treasure hunts. I mean, it's only one or box now, but seriously, like every time I see a big group like this at the Wally, I, it's very hard to see a treasure hunt now. Crazy. All right, what do we have at the next store? We did crack this case. Let's see what was popular. It looks like Home and Moody is there. Stingray is there. I don't remember the rest. I see one mongoose, so that was popular. Gosh, the, the oh, the, the Nova, right? The turtle wax. Wow, both of those are gone. That's crazy. Very popular. I'm surprised the Bel Air is still here. It's, it's a really nice die cast. The pink grape crate 1957 Chevrolet Bel Air. It does look cool. I mean, knowing it's, knowing it's, you know, that, 
kind of makes it hard for me to buy personally. I already have I already have Bel Airs. They're like NOS ones and stuff, but that one's really cool. Oh wow, do you guys remember these? They were returned, oh man, it's gotta be months by now. I wish I knew when the video was when we first saw that these came back. I know someone returned them. They thought they could sell them, but no. Nobody wants those. All right, well, Walmarts are sporadic right now. Things come in, then they don't, then they do. It's whatever. We're in transition, even Walmarts. It's okay. We'll get through it. This is not the first time we've gone through a transition phase. Uh, normally, Walmarts, you don't really feel the transition as much as a target. But I'm thinking this time we're going to feel it a little bit, but it's all good. We, we will adapt, we will overcome. Yeah, I'm gonna get it. I left it and I'm like, why? I like it, it's cool. Mongoose, 497, five bucks. Yeah, that really got me thinking, the whole cast line, you know, M2 chase thing. If they just put one model that is designated as a chase, now they can produce way less items. Their cost on production will be way less because then they don't have to make every single item a chase. Oh, swinging pegs. Somebody was doing something here at the Haba Laba. I don't think we missed anything uh, in our last, oh, the Corvette. We have that, we opened it. Oh, we opened both of those, remember? The dart. I don't think we missed anything. I'm only here really because I'm curious of what's left of these and I honestly am only seeing two, the Bel Air which actually looks really nice. Ooh, love it. Some more right here. Mm, man, do I get an extra set? That's my problem now, is do I get an extra set? It doesn't look like much is left, right? Dude, we had like a whole case, unless they're just all mixed in somewhere. Let me see. Let me see if I can find them all and then maybe we'll get Another set, I do have another set on the way anyway, I hope, I mean, it's not guaranteed, especially since I, you know, did this other one the other day. Nothing's guaranteed, nothing's guaranteed. Well, huh, I don't know, I don't know, maybe they're gone. The only other one I see is right here, but they could be mixed in. I'm gonna have to really take a look here, and I am taking a look. So the Monte Carlo and then the Monte Carlo, maybe somebody got some, I mean, that'd be great, you know? I mean, wait, how many did I get? I only got a couple, they had two. Uh, so let's say they had two and then those are twos from the case so if i got three oh so only one would be missing anyway right because i got three okay uh it was the really cool blue cadillac coupe de ville i think somebody grabbed it but good for them it's cool it's cool i'm gonna grab a couple extras i do like the bel air and the orange caprice i kind of want to open one and i mean this one is cool but is it really you know it's not awful I'm not a big 70s car guy. I don't know. The design just gets so weird in the 70s. Oh, yeah, look, there's even like a little dent on the package. Dude, I I've always wanted to open a green light collectibles car and check them out. You know, we've done M2. We did Auto World, obviously Hot Wheels. Let's see if somebody got the Tommy Chase. Huh, maybe they did. Well, I don't remember. Yeah, I think somebody found it. Oh, no, there's a Tommy right there, but that was the main... Oh yeah, there's Tommy the normal. What's that one back there? I can't see. Yeah, I don't see, oh, Fennec Shand. I have a chase of that, I think, unless I gave it away, because I don't really like them, but. Yeah, I don't see the other Tommy. Somebody got a chase. Uh, some of you guys in the Lamb League group chat today on whatnot, that was really fun. I mean, I, I don't know. My shows are really fun, but it was fun to see you guys in the chat. And that's cool that he was giving away those IDs, right? We're just talking about IDs and how we're wondering what happened. And he gave us the answer. Mattel doesn't even, they didn't even know if they made them. Like they, like, they weren't even thinking of making the IDs. What is this? This is weird. There's like some new, I don't, this doesn't look new. This is old. There's an old haul. See, dude, I'm telling you, 7,800 pieces. What's the year? 18, 2018, there's a Mustang 2 plus 2 in there. Um, say what? This could be a pre-chase piece also. Like a pre, we didn't put stickers on there piece also. It has red wheels. Gosh, maybe we should look it up just to see any information. Uh, it could have easily been looked over. 
8,400 pieces, 22, Ford Ranger, and then this, oh, this one could have a chase here, it says. Yo, so yeah, see now, instead of everything having to have a chase, they only have to make one item have a chase. And I would imagine this isn't it with all the black wheels and the silver and the silver bumpers, uh, but it's a hauler anyway, I'm not too crazy. However, an older hauler, that's actually not in like the worst shape. I'm gonna look it up and see, because again, they do have these older ones without the without the sticker. Uh, they put out some two packs, one, two, three, four are left, so, oh, the 350, that's right, the import heat. Yeah, we got those. We got those already, unless it's the recolor. I did not get the recolor. We do have the spam car. We do have another spam car, both in silver, and those would be the chase for that auto driver series. We'll just do a quick once over, some Bel Airs in there. Yeah, I don't see. Yep, yeah, it looks like the whole case is still here, two and two. Uh, but both of the spams are nothing. Okay, cool, yeah, this is a pre-chase sticker item and the chase is gold. So the same thing they did with the Famoco truck, if you remember is what they did with that. Oh, it even says Fomoko on it. I mean, I'm, I'm a real smart guy. There it is. So it's like the same thing, just older. That's so weird. Uh, and someone asked how could they like return old stuff on a new receipt in the comments. It's because the barcodes are all the same. Like they don't change. You know what I mean? One, three, two, one on the bootlegger. Uh, one, five, two, one. So that one's a little different, but I know like all of these, uh, 701, they have always been that same code. So a lot of the M2 stuff, they don't change the barcodes on. Yeah, that's cool. I'm gonna leave that old one back there for somebody that's really into it. So 8,400, 7,800. So not, it's, it's not that crazy of a low production number. I've seen other items that are lower that are even newer even. But anyway, that's cool, that's cool. I hope somebody got something good out of these newer ones. And I'd really like to know where that came from. Oh, it's backwards in there, look. All right, it was opened. Yeah, for sure. Look, the M2 is 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 backwards. It should face forward like those ones. The diecast detective is on the case. <laughs> when in doubt, we hit the grocery store. And I actually have never been to this one for Hot Wheels. I mean, I've been to this grocery store. I've just never looked for Hot Wheels here. So I've said, you know what? Let's take a little ride. What do we got? All the same stuff. Kit concept. Probably been here forever. Hot wired. Custom Camaro. Ooh, there's the new corvette right oh look at that could you imagine oh. c7z06 i think i have these like in a red edition or something what else is here another corvette and another fantasy what a shame right wouldn't that be great it's so crazy the wheels look so much like the soup even on the main man i wish i wish that's a nice card too pretty nice i'm gonna put you right there surprise somebody all right, nothing, we got that thing. Oh, what's that? Oh, the custom Ford Maverick. I have heard about you. Oh, another Batmobile. Make sure there's no like, sign, you know, anything under there, just in case it's some kind of card error. Oh, I do like them. I like the color, I like everything about it. I hope we see the soup someday. If we don't, it's fine. Oh, the blue uh, A-case. Wow, so they're still on A-case. Batman again, all right, all right. Wow, the Batmans are everywhere. Wow, there's, all right, all right, hold on. I'm gonna make some room here. This stuff's falling off. Really cool El Camino, I do love that one. Oh, there's a Mercedes, uh-oh. What's gonna happen, guys? It's right there. Oh, man, that's a shame. Wouldn't that have been so much fun to pull El Soup Arena? Oh, man, darn. Even if I had the bent corner, I wouldn't even care. International card, Bill Steen, Mercedes-Benz 300 SL from the B case. Oh man, that would have been cool. All right, we do have one more small section here. We'll take a quick look. Another Batmobile. Make sure it's not one of those weird errors. Nope, everything's normal on the main. And the bone shaker, wow. When I went like this, I could see like just that, you know, that part right there. So I couldn't even see the wheel, but it's all good, it's all good, right? I'm sure the Super looks amazing with that red Spectra flame. Well, I was wow. just about to leave and then I said, you know what, I better ask somebody. And I said, is there any other Hot Wheels? Because I know sometimes they have a toy section too. 
And uh, he goes, yeah, actually, go to this aisle. So they had that, uh, what was it? Oh, that's a Hot Wheels 80s car? Uh-oh, we might have to buy that since I wanted them all. I'm trying to see custom 11 Camaro. I'm like, I'm, I'm, I'm skipping ahead, trying to see if anything's good. Ooh, that's a nice card. Yeah, yeah, another international 80s, because I want all the Hot Wheels of the 80s. Ford Cosworth, shout out to Ken Block, do it for Ken. But yeah, they uh, they said, yeah, go check this area. So good thing we did that. Group C Fantasy, you are a Group C Fantasy. And uh, El Camino again, uh, teed off. Let me just move these over. Another Mustang, wow, there's a ton of those. They, that, that color seems to be being left. I can only imagine with a good set of wheels, like one of the Ninja Turtle van wheels or something, you know, because they're bigger in the back and stuff. Baja Bone Shaker. Oh, the Skate Grom. I do like that one. I think I got it fresh out of that B case maybe or somewhere. Hot Wheel Sports. Chris Rednick. Shout out to Subi. The Gotta Go. I know people, I mean, I, I don't know. I hate the Gotta Go. I actually you know got that. nervous because when I was walking up to the aisle, I saw this and I'm like, no, there's no way. And then I was able to look down a little bit and I saw the Hot Wheels. Oh, Ford GT, Porsche, wow. Look at Matchbox stepping up their game, huh? Jaguar in there. Oh, cool, check it out. It's number one of 10. This is, oh, look at that 80s logo, wow. Th these are great. I definitely want to get the whole mini set. 